Hey guys, I'm LB, and we are back playing more Ignition! Because, uh, yeah. I don't know what I was gonna say after because, but yeah, so let's see. Does this cube... Yes, this cube still has a song in its head, and, uh, we're gonna just hope that we can solve the puzzle without that. Wow, this laser is just barely... just barely on this cube. That's actually quite amazing. Alright, so... Let's see, so last time, I believe, we- we activated this light bridge, right? And then we looked around a bit and decided to end the episode. <laughs> because there's not very much you can do in this map in just half an hour. This is interesting. Definitely don't want to touch it. Also, isn't it- isn't this sideways? I don't think it's supposed to be in this orientation. But it is a really different looking laser field anyway. Oh yeah, I should probably also quick save at some point so that I can quick load. Let's uh, let's walk over here to this guy and, you know, get him re-centered. Save and continue. Yeah, he's still got a song in his head, and he's still gonna keep moving, which is quite frustrating. I don't know why it's like that. Just a bug in the game, I guess. What is this for? Oh, whoops. Whatever. <laughs> um... I mean, I guess we could do that, right? We could suspend a cube in the air like that. Okay, so here's my question, right? How do we even begin with that there? That's what I want to know. This. I want to see how long that actually lasts. Uh, there. Thank you. And nope, nope, this way actually. Let's see, that should theoretically work. Maybe. Yeah, there we go. So that definitely disables just that fizzler. Oh, and, uh, it actually sticks through the wall a little bit because... <laughs> it's not properly made. That's fine. How long does it last? Not very long at all. About maybe one second, maybe one and a half seconds? Huh. What about this other one over here? I think we'll want to set things up so that we can... Well... We can pause the funnel whenever we want, so never mind about that. How do I aim at that? <laughs> why do I- why would I ever want this to be sideways? That's something I still don't understand. even any portal surface over there, is there? <sighs> ah, 
screw you. That cube with the song in its head, it, it beatboxed its way off of the f connector again. Tell me I, that I don't have to go in there myself. Because if I have to go in there myself, that's gonna be a nightmare. I don't even know how I would set that up. Theoretically, I could place that there and, you know, that here and that here and that would lift me up. But... Activate the light bridge... ...and... then... activate this fizzler... ...or deactivate it, rather. And then I don't care what happens. No, I also have to- I also have to do that one! That's three different things I have to do. want that to be sideways. I still do not understand that. I guess if you place your portal like this, it would help, right? Yeah, that's what it's for. That's just an alternative method to the madness. You know what? I figured it out. Let's, let's make sure this guy with this song in his head doesn't completely screw us over. Give me that. We need to set each of these up... ...in advance. See, this is the one... yeah, that's right there. Yeah, basically we're just gonna rewind them. To queue up our actions. So let's see. Last thing we need to happen is that. And then a long break. So let's work on getting that activated from here. Because they all have to be here when they activate one of these things. We've got to mess around with finding just the right angles. Oh. Actually, 
the... More like this. Okay, so there's that. want to rewind, effectively. Let me go fix this guy again. He's about to screw us over. And also, I want a quick save here. So now, we rewind. Let's give ourselves some time here. that might be too much time. Alright. So then... we we'll use this guy... and we want to aim... first at... the... the one with the timer. go. We'll go reposition this guy now. Alright, so now we rewind it some more. And we'll use these other two cubes for the light bridge. Now, one of them will be the activator. Once we get in there, we can try and activate... ...this... ...I think? Might be what the ceiling area is for? So this one will just indefinitely point at the light bridge. Uh, which is gonna be... Oh, mostly the same. Let's see, can we get that to work? Yeah, there we go. Alright. We'll readjust the one with the song in its head. This guy probably could have been pulled back more to give us more time. But we can fix it relatively easily, actually. Okay, let's see how this is gonna play out. Yeah, that's why it's got a timer on it. Yeah, so then there's that. Alright. So that can give us more time. Let's set this guy up again, so that we have more time before we have to use him. with a song in its head. Do you still have a song in your head? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. And you're actually okay for right now. Just stay that way, please. Okay, now let's rewind this. Let's get the light bridge on again. Oh, maybe that was too much time. Ooh, just... Oh no, we were good! Okay, we had... yeah, okay. This is cool, this is like- this is like queuing up a recording here. Alright. Let's so double check this guy. Okay, so, now... This guy... We are going to put him... Where is a good place to put him? We're gonna put him over here-ish? Yeah. And then... This will go... here. Well, we're gonna have to do that from in there anyway. 
Alright, one more time. Save. Oh, that's a little bit too far back. Alright. And let's see if we can do this properly. Hopefully I set this up right, because if not... We're gonna have a heck of a time... ...trying to figure out how to fix it. Stay on the button. Huh. What would be a good way to fi- Oh! Oh, we can use the funnel! Duh. Alright. Oh, I would've just- What just happened there? Oh, right, okay, yeah, it's just- it's just- it's just the game doing its thing. Oh no, actually we need it to... be started in the first place. Don't mess with me, Cube. I know you've got a song on your head, and I know you like that song, but that song, it needs to stop playing, okay? I didn't think this part through. Uh... Oh no. That's bad. That was totally it though. Problem is, this fizzler needs to be deactivated again. Let's try this again. See if I can get exactly one cube in there. Might have to do this three times total, actually. Which what wait, how would we do that though? Because then we wouldn't have enough cubes. So, we can- we got- we successfully did that, right? But... The issue... The issue is that once we've done that, what do we do next? It's like we need the Fizzler... ...to deactivate... ...a second time. Time, but we don't have enough cubes for that. Oh, right, I need to go in there. 
and grab a cube. But then the... Mm, the Fizzler will be active again, and that is a problem. Cubes. We don't have enough cubes. We have all five cubes that the map has given us so far, and it feels like I need one more. Just one more cube! over in a moment. to do... Say we're at that window, right? We fire a portal... Uh, let's see if I can get between this spot and there, yeah. So we fire a portal here, right? And then... we go against the laser wall. That could allow us to aim... laser at the ceiling. And then what? Or we could- yo, we, could we just aim it at our own fizzler again? Yeah. Turn off the fizzler again, but... The problem that I'm worried about is how to get the cube off the button. Suppose we could... We have to be quick about things, though. Okay, so... We need to get our body in there. But other than that, this is mostly the same. Let's see if I can do this again. here now, right? Ah, uh, no! Get me up here! No! <laughs> I missed my chance. Alright. Try it again, though. I definitely have the timing right, that's for sure. Wait a sec. What am I doing? What is that area for? Can't I just get a cube to come through and then... pull it... through there? Do I even need to do anything with that at all? Alright, hang on. Let's save this as... Save Ignition A. There. So now, we're gonna... We're gonna change out... the program here. I wanna reactivate that. 
once these other cubes have gone through. How could I set that up, though? I actually don't think I can do that. Because the funnel... Yeah... This is cleverly designed so that you can't do that. Alright, so that save was for nothing. Let's, uh... Let's make sure this guy's not gonna screw us over. And then let's just do it again. Cause yeah, cause... It's hard to explain, but basically, they would have to be further apart than they physically can be in the funnel in order for that to work. I was hoping I could just get the cubes to come up through there and then pull them back to the fizzler, but no, that's never gonna work. Alright. Oh, come on. I thought I had it centered over the button, apparently not. Let's see... Why is it not working now? Come on, game! I did it twice before, and now it doesn't want to stay on the button. Oops. Wrong key. Oops. I missed my opportunity that time. Man, this is tricky. Serious right now. There we go. Did it this time. Can you get my body in here, please? Yes! Did it. Alright. Oh, that was. That was close. Did I get both of them? Uh, crap. Did one of them end up in there? That sucks. I guess it doesn't really matter too much. Alright, so... Oh no, we got both of them! <laughs> we did get both of them, alright. Also, I'm glad I created that manual save, because now I can safely quick save here. We can go from here from now on. And if I ever need to go back to the other manual save, we can. So I think <laughs> that with that, uh yeah, I think that is the end of this episode. So as always, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. I will see you all in the next episode. Which might be short or might still be long, because I don't know how much of the map we have left. Goodbye!